Hey guys. Wanted you to see the rainbow behind me. Hopefully you can see. It's raining, so wipe this off. There we go. <clears throat> anyway, the rainbow is here. The sunset is gorgeous. Just wanted to show y'all the beauty and let you enjoy the sound of the birds with me. I know so many of you on the mainland are already asleep, so you'll be seeing this tomorrow. So if you are seeing this, whether you're live or catching the replay, please leave me a comment and let me know how your weather is lately. Hopefully you're getting some sun. Hopefully you've read the studies about how important it is to get outside. That's what strengthens your immune system. And I just wanted you all to consider how important it is for the vitamin D. And yes, you get it best from the sunlight. And I've um, heard that you need to expose the backs of your knees to sunlight and it, it um, helps your body to start synthesizing vitamin D. And if not, I recommend taking a vitamin D supplement. And if you know that you're vitamin D deficient, you've been tested, you need to be taking between five and 10,000 IUs a day. So I had to do that for a while. I gotta show you guys this. <coughs> There's a sunset. Anyway, that vitamin D is so important for health and wellness and strengthening your immune system. So make sure you're getting outside every single day. When I was doing my healing protocol this winter in Palm Springs, I was um, out for every single sunrise and every single sunset. I wish that you guys could see that sun more clearly. It gets a little blurred out on the screen, but it is so pretty. Um, the other recommendation is vitamin A. Make sure that you're taking that. I purchased both of my vitamin D and vitamin A from a company called Seeking Health, and that is founded by Dr. Ben Lynch. You should follow him on Instagram, and he has an awesome book called Dirty Genes, where he teaches about how um, your genes can become defective from the toxins in our environment and he gives protocols for how to repair them, which is pretty cool information. So if you have MTHFR, I would get that book for sure. <laughs> I know that I have HLA-DR, which means I don't clear biotoxins out of my body effectively like the majority of people, which is partly why I got so sick this winter. Um, anyway, another awesome awesome piece of information for you all is zinc. I buy my zinc from Thorn. Thorn is the pharmaceutical, not pharmaceutical company, what am I saying? A vitamin supplement company. I buy that zinc from Thorn and I buy quercetin. Quercetin opens up your cells. It helps um, for the zinc to be consumed or used by the cells effectively. So hopefully this info is helpful. Um, again, the vitamin A and D I buy from Seeking Health and the zinc and quercetin I buy from Thorn, and that's T-H-O-R-N-E. And I buy my Thorn products from iHerb.com and Seeking Health, you buy them directly from them. So anyway, I don't make any money from that. I just want you guys to all hear about it and hopefully that it will help you keep healthy and strong. And oh, I've got so many things to share with you guys that I've incorporated this year. Another thing is the vitamin C. I hope you guys are taking it. Are any of you taking any of the vitamins I've recommended so far? Vitamin A, D, C, Zinc, Quercetin. <laughs> These are all immune supplement um, modulators. They help your immune system strengthen and through my um, challenges this winter. I've learned a lot about the immune system. So hopefully I've been prepared for this here. The sun is just going down. Oh my gosh, I gotta get you on that. I wonder if I'll see a green flash tonight. So pretty. Um, Dirty Jeans is written by Dr. Ben Lynch. You can order that on Amazon. So worth reading. You guys will love that book. I've been talking about that on my Instagram stories. And let's see no green flash. <laughs> Shoot. I was hoping I would see that tonight. Anyway, Seeking Health has an incredible quality vitamin C. I take buffered because it hurts my stomach if I don't. And I like doing vitamin C flushes. Um, flushes, what they do are um, you take vitamin C every 15 to 20 minutes until you reach bowel tolerance. And it's 
just what it sounds like, okay? And um, basically what it does is it gives your body so much vitamin C that then your body can use the vitamin C to put out some of the fires of inflammation and people with chronic illness and chronic inflammation which is what I was diagnosed with called SIRS meaning chronic inflammatory response syndrome CIRS um, basically their body is like on fire all the time and it's so so bad to have inflammation <laughs> and so I discovered something that really helped me was the vitamin C flush and you just do that every day for a week um, I you guys wouldn't believe this the first day that I did the vitamin C flush I took 50 grams of vitamin C <laughs> the good news is though um, subsequently after that each day you take 75% less until you reach the amount that you're not having bowel intolerance and that's just what it sounds like um, but then you are um, basically your body's taking all that um, available vitamin C and using it to start put out the inflammatory inflammation fires in your body um, so that's something cool to learn about anyway I need to write a blog post on that I have the coffee enema blog post up I just um, re-edited it, it today it's on elisleidinger.com and then I have another blog post I'm working on about the liver flush so if you guys were watching my Instagram stories today one of my best friends Nicole did the liver flush today and so I put her stories up there so you guys can go and watch that um, very effective and really helps helps even to clear negative emotions because we hold a lot of negativity and anger in our liver so if you're having digestive issues you're having pain in the right upper quadrant um, you're having a lot of anger issues in patients it might be time for liver flush maybe <laughs> anyway I'm gonna write about that on a blog post too if you guys are interested hey Jesse my sister is about to do one she keeps telling me she did the first coffee anime yesterday I'm sure she wants to be announcing that to all the world but I have to Jesse you just missed our rainbow we had up here and then our sunset I'll show you the last bits of it there really really pretty night tonight you can see the pink on the horizon it's so pretty and I'm standing in the rain very light rain Anyway, just wanted to come on and say hi and share some of those tips with you all. And I've got so much more up my sleeve. My, my Detox Life podcast is almost ready to launch. Almost ready. Like, oh my gosh, I hope we could have it up sometime in May. That's my plan. So hopefully you'll enjoy that. And I hope you guys have a great night. Mwah! Love ya. <laughs>